Hey everybody, this is Dancing Diamond for you guys again today here on another segment of how to be a stripper. Um, on this one, we're going to actually talk about how guys like to spend their money. So I've been seeing a whole lot of social media posts talking about, and mind you, this is from a lot of single younger men, not, not older guys, but a lot of single younger men. You know, they're saying that dancing and bartending, yes, bartending included, <laughs> are not real jobs. So it blew my mind reading all these posts and reading all of these comments because a lot of these guys that are saying that bartending and, sorry, bartending and dancing are not real jobs are the same guys that can't afford to go into a strip club and have that kind of entertainment, okay? So I just want to say first and foremost, just because you don't have enough financial status to cover your own fantasies doesn't mean that someone else doesn't, okay? Because someone else definitely does, all right? Men really do like to spend their money. I mean, a lot of good financially stable men, they like to spend their money on females. They like to spend their money on women. They like to spoil. They love to see their women happy, okay? And you know what? Just because you don't want to spend the money, that's perfectly okay. Don't come into a strip club and don't dog on other dancers or dog on other bartenders just because a financial meet doesn't meet quite your status, okay? Some guys, it's just me, um, but between me and quite a few other dancers that I've known and even just seeing videos online on YouTube and everything else like that, a lot of guys really do like to be made fun of. A lot of guys really do like to be financially dominated. A lot of people, you know, they like to be abused. They really do, you know. They don't have that type of dominance in their life from another female, so they don't mind giving their money and spending it with another female that's willing to do those things for that person, okay? Me? I absolutely love to be spoiled. I love when a guy can come up to me and take down that shy wall and have enough confidence to come up to me and say, hey, or even just send me a message on one of my social medias and just say, hey, I want to spoil you today. I want to be your sugar daddy today. I want to provide you with stuff today just because I think you are so beautiful and you make amazing videos or you take amazing photos or, you know, something of that nature. I love when guys do that, okay? And a lot of other females love, 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 love when they get spoiled too, okay? But that doesn't mean that dancing and bartending is not a real job just because you can't afford it and you don't meet the same standards as other guys do. So, I love to dance, I love to be happy, I love to have fun, and I know a lot of other dancers and bartenders do as well. If you don't want to spend the money, that is perfectly okay, and that's fine, but don't sit there and make dancers and bartenders feel bad about their job, and not only that, but stop making other guys feel like for some reason they should be, or feel insecure about the fact that they want to be with another beautiful woman in that aspect and in that way. You're kind of making yourself look like a jackass, to be honest with you. So, in conclusion, just because you don't want to spend the money doesn't mean somebody else doesn't want to. And ladies, 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 do not get discouraged by seeing all these social media posts or anything like that. Because you know what? Dancing is a job. We provide a good sexual fantasy for men that don't get to have that or enjoy that at home. So, you ladies have fun, you guys enjoy yourselves, and you know what? Screw anyone that says that dancing and bartending isn't a real job. And for the men out there that do love to spoil, screw those other guys that feel the need to say that you're stupid for spending your money the way that you guys do, okay? There is nothing wrong with being financially dominated. There is nothing wrong with spending your hard-earned money how you choose and how you like it and how you want to please. 
That's on you, boo boo. Everyone else. I'll say it. 